The new Cookie No Rookie Cloak is now available at the Bad Lion store. Use the code COOKIE for 10% off. Hey, what's going on, you guys? It's Cookie No Rookie, and today we got another video for you guys. So today, I wanted to talk about two different swords and if they are better than each other. With the new Dungeons update, it brought a few more things, and uh, we're going to test out a Gilded Midas, which is also recombobulated to Mythic, as well as having the Midas Jewel on it, so we get the 90 damage plus 90 strength, brings it up to almost 400 damage and 240 strength, which is pretty cool, but keep in mind it does now not have the crit damage. So if we go over to the aspect of the dragons, we also recombobulate it and uh, we have the fabled reforge on this and we're going to see if the AOTD is still better than a Midas sword with a dragon pet and then we're also going to test without a dragon pet. So I realized my whole tuck set was on a wise reforge and I didn't have fierce on it or anything else which is hilarious to me because i was doing dragons yesterday i want to say yesterday night and uh i was really doing a lot of damage and i was only using a wise frozen <laughs> tuck set or frozen blaze helmet with a full tuck set which was just it's funny to me because knowing i could have done a lot more damage we do have it on fierce and like i said we're gonna be using our dragon pet and we're gonna see if the gilded midas is better than a fabled aspect of the dragons with a dragon pet in the end and then we're gonna try on an armor stand on the island with a tiger pet and versus the dragon pet and i also have a fabled midas just to see if the gilded midas is even better than that so let's go ahead and hit a mob 436k 436k that is ridiculous so if we switch to our aspect of the dragons here 460 450 and then the midas like we said does 436k consistently 423 455 423 so it does look like the AOTD does do more damage still than a Gilded Midas. So what I wanted to do next was try a Fabled Aspect, or not a Fable. We're going to try a Fabled Midas, 399, 445, 389, 418. It looks like the Gilded does more consistent higher damage, 411. 403 yeah so the gilded midas definitely is better than a fabled um every once in a while you'll get a crit that's higher than the 436k i'm getting right now but is it worth not getting that consistent damage and getting less damage if you know what i mean so like sometimes you'll get a higher crit with the fabled versus the gilded but the gilded does more dps i feel like because it's a consistently high crit damage versus this one which could be lower etc etc we're gonna sword swap with an aspect of the dragons now 843 957 k we almost just hit for a full million crit damage which is insane 951 k oh my god that is ridiculous but in the end with an aspect versus a midas um with a dragon pet keep that in mind it does buff the aspect of the dragons the aspect of the dragons is still better so what i want to do right now is i'm going to go get a armor stand not an armor stand but a dummy i guess you could say and we're going to test it out on our island all right so let's recap quickly what we know already and that is that the aspect of the dragons is still better than a fully maxed out gilded midas sword and uh the fabled midas it just doesn't compete with the gilded midas i feel i tried it in the end before and it just doesn't 
seem to be doing more damage than the Gilded Midas consistently. So what we're going to try now is the Dragon Pet outside of the end. It's going to be on my island with a training dummy. And we're going to be testing out if it can do more damage outside of the end as well. So we're going to do 437k consistently with the Midas. And if we switch to the aspect 416, now you're thinking that's lower. But if we keep hitting it, 452, 428, 436, 468, 460, 440. It's just really inconsistent damage, which is very weird to me. But it does do a shit ton more damage when it does crit. The only thing is that the Midas is just consistently 437k, which is very high with the AOTD. You do happen to get lower crits here and there but uh when it crits higher it's a lot higher like 484 right there 428 which was lower so i feel like the higher crits make up for it and just make the aotd a tiny bit better than the gilded midas now i'm gonna switch to a tiger pet and we're gonna do that 231 240 250 220 250 244 244 225 and if we go ahead and use the midas 274 consistently back to the aotd 223 midas would be way better to use than an aotd without a dragon pet and this would be with any other damage pet the midas beats the aotd but if you're using a dragon pet and keep in mind it was a legendary dragon pet so we did get the 10 percent stat increase um it, it the aotd is still just a tiny bit better than the midas and uh, it's up to you guys to figure if it's worth it or not aotd dragon pet is such a lot of coins that it's really not worth it but you see the damage we do and that we can do and that is a lot a lot of damage guys i hope you enjoyed this video in comparison and maybe it helped you out maybe you drop a like on the video and maybe you go ahead and check out the new cloak we have on bad lion store use code cookie at check out for an extra 10% off link will be in the description to the cape and uh, I hope you guys liked the video and we'll see you guys next time peace out everybody